Hello everybody, this is Brother Luke, Sim City Preacher. I hope you had a great uh, Christmas celebration. My family here in Las Vegas, uh, uh, we all got together at, at my home. Uh, my wife and I had uh, family and friends over for Christmas dinner. And uh, we enjoyed some great company. Uh, afterwards we had a great visit and we we decided to reminisce and go back to the the olden days when we were kids and our parents were still alive with us and relive a kind of a custom that, that we did so many years ago and that is that rather than sitting around and watching TV in those days, we would gather together and recite poetry, read poetry to each other. We had a lot of books of poetry. In fact, my older brother, the, the late, great Brent Boozer, uh, he wrote a lot of poems, and I believe he's one of the greatest poets who's ever lived. Uh, I did recite one of his poems and it's on my YouTube channel uh, that uh, you can listen to that if you like. It's uh, called Scarlet Lover. But he's got hundreds of poems that are great. So we loved reading poetry and my brother was a great poet. It turns out my son is talented as a poet. He doesn't write much of it, but what he's done has been excellent. I don't really have any talent as a poet, but I appreciate it. And we really had a great time. And it took me back to my my youth and remembering the good old days of our family time. I recited a poem uh, that night that I thought might be uh, very good for everybody to consider now. So I'm going to recite it now. I'm actually going to read it because I don't have it memorized. Uh, but I think that as the year ends, this would be a very good poem to reflect on, analyze our lives, and and see if uh, how we um, how, how we measure up to the message in this poem. Uh, the poem is titled "If." by Rudyard Kipling. If you can keep your head when all about you are losing theirs and blaming it on you. If you can trust yourself when all men doubt you but make allowance for their doubting too. If you can wait and not be tired by waiting or being lied about, don't deal in lies. Or being hated, don't give way to hating. And yet, don't look too good nor talk too wise. If you can dream and not make dreams your master. If you can think and not make thoughts your aim. If you can meet with triumph and disaster and treat those two imposters just the same. If you can bear to hear the truth you've spoken, twisted by knaves to make a trap for fools, or watch the things you gave your life to broken, and stoop and build them up with worn-out tools. If you can make one heap of all your winnings and risk it on one turn of pitch and toss and lose and start again at your beginnings, and never breathe a word about your loss. If you can force your heart and nerve and sinew to serve your turn long after they are gone, and so hold on when there is nothing in you except the will which says to them, hold on. If you can talk with crowds and keep your virtue, or walk with kings nor lose the common touch. If neither foes nor loving friends can hurt you, 
If all men count with you, but none too much. If you can fill the unforgiving minute with 60 seconds worth of distance run. Yours is the earth and everything that's in it. And which is more, you'll be a man, my son. Encouraging words for me. I hope this poem is a blessing to you. Bless you in the name of our great Savior God, Jesus Christ.